In this video, we will show you how to force recompile shaders in Starfield. The first thing to do is to exit the Starfield game if you are running it. Then you need to delete Starfield's existing shader cache files so that it is forced to compile them again from scratch. To delete shader cache files for NVIDIA users, go to local app data, then NVIDIA folder, and then DX cache. The easiest way to do this is to input these in the search bar. Delete all files inside the DX cache folder. You may get a warning that some files are in use, but delete any files that you can. For AMD users, you can input these to access the DX cache. Also delete pipeline.cache. You can input these in the search bar to be able to go directly to the folder. Now try to start the game and it should start building shaders. Now if it does not compile shaders when you open the game, here's what to do for NVIDIA users. You can open NVIDIA control panel. In the manage 3D settings, go to shader cache size and select disabled. Then re-enable it again after you have select apply. For AMD users, open Radeon software and go to graphics, advanced, and then reset shader cache. Now, if it does not still compile the shaders, what you can do is go to safe mode and access again the DX cache and then delete the files. Recompiling shaders is a handy troubleshooting step if you experience crashes, low FPS, or visual defects in Starfield. While deleting the shader cache folders is simple, it can take trial and error to force the game to properly rebuild them. I hope that this guide has been helpful to you. Please don't forget to support the channel by subscribing. Thanks for watching.